Hello and welcome to Study with Sudhir presenting the answer key to the ICSC class 10 physics board examination paper for semester 2. I am given to understand that compared to semester 1 this was easy though there were a couple of googly questions as well and I will explain in the course of this video what those googly questions were. Let us look at the 10 MCQs first. The first one free vibrations are the vibrations under the influence of periodic force, the vibrations with larger amplitude, the vibrations when the frequency continuously decreases or D the vibrations with a constant frequency and constant amplitude. The correct option is D the vibrations with a constant frequency and constant amplitude. You have been given a diagram showing four sound waves which uh, wave has the highest pitch is what you need to identify the correct one is B wave B. The third one the graph plotted for potential difference against current for ohmic resistors is the correct option is C a straight line passing through origin. Question number four a main switch in the main distribution board is present in a live wire, a neutral wire, a live as well as neutral wire or D an earth wire. The correct option is C uh, and here uh, the mis chances of a mistake are high because students may mark A if they do not know about the double pole switch. Let us move to question number 5. And here the correct option is D, the needle will deflect towards the west. Question number 6, a coil wound wound around a piece of soft iron can become an electromagnet only when? For the sixth question, the correct option is D, a current flows in the circuit. Only in that condition it can become an electromagnet. The seventh question, the correct option is C for the seventh question 4 joules per gram per degree Celsius. For the eighth question water is used in car radiators because the correct option is deep its specific heat capacity is very high so it can cool the engine without a greater increase in its own temperature. Let us move to the ninth question the heaviest nuclear radiation is the correct option is B, alpha radiation. The tenth question, to study the age of excavated material of archaeological significance, we study the rate of decay of an isotope of carbon. So that is as far as the MCQs are concerned. Let us now move to section B. Of course, you have to do three questions, but we will deal with all the, the answer key to all the questions. Okay, now the second question and this is what most students seem to have had a doubt about. After studying the circuit and the magnetic compass carefully, state whether switch S1 is open or closed. The moment it was written carefully, that was an indication that students will make a mistake with this googly question. And some students seem to have erred here. The switch S1 is open. Students should know that the off condition of a switch is called an open switch, right? B. How did you arrive at the conclusion in A, whether you gave it as open or closed? Because the circuit is discontinuous or you could have written the compass needle is pointing geographic north-south which implies that the coil AB is not magnetic. What is the purpose of placing the magnetic compass in the above setup. The deflection in the compass indicates that the coil is behaving at a magnet which is possible only on the passage of current. Okay, so that is as far as this particular question is concerned. Now let us move to 2A. We give an important reason for copper to be used as a material for a calorimeter. The specific heat capacity of copper is low and this is the operative part and especially if they are going by the word important. But students may also write that it takes negligible amount of heat from its co contents to attain thermal equilibrium. Okay. Now let us look at uh, calculate the thermal capacity of 40 grams of water 
and this is the way this needs to be calculated okay the conversion becomes extremely important students should not have forgotten to do the conversion right now we move to the third one and this is how it has to be calculated the entire thing the external resistance of circuit the current i2 and the current i this is the way the entire thing has to be calculated let's now move to question number 3 three wires with proper color coding are connected to the three terminals of a three pin socket match the wire color of the wire with the proper terminals a b and c of the socket a will be green b will be light blue and c will be brown if the students have made a mistake and read three pin socket as a three pin plug they may have possibly committed a mistake there they would have interchanged b and c which would have been wrong okay i hope you did not do so second a why does it become colder after a hailstorm than during or before the hailstorm well after the hailstorm every gram of ice at zero degree celsius absorbs 336 joules of energy to melt and form water at zero degree celsius from the surroundings or you could have worded it a little differently saying that the specific latent heat of melting of ice is 336 joules per gram which is absorbed by ice to convert to water from the surroundings thus bringing a cooling effect okay the b question you need to state whether the given statement is true or false the statement is false as it is not given that they are of the same mass the third one uh, about a metal piece this is the way you need to calculate this one it will come to 0.168 joules per gram per degree celsius okay let's move to question number four the first answer of a name one characteristic that is different for waves from the two different instruments is quality of timber we had done that as part of our YouTube questions also. If now the loudness of the sound from flute becomes four times that of the sound from piano, then write the ratio AF to AP. Okay. Uh, now here, AF by AP equals two by one. Define pitch of a sound. Pitch is that characteristic of sound which differentiates two sounds with similar loudness and quality. Let's move to the one name two factors on which the force experienced by a conductor carrying current placed in a magnetic field depends also state how these factors affect the force force is directly proportional to the strength of the external magnet force is directly proportional to the magnitude of current force is directly proportional to the length of the wire within the magnetic field any two of these three would be correct you have to mention two factors any two of these three factors that i've mentioned would be correct with the help of which rule you can determine the direction this would be the Fleming's left hand rule then we come to what is nuclear energy the energy obtained due to loss in mass during a nuclear change is called nuclear energy right this is as per the scope of the class 10 syllabus the next one is beta radiation B then C, this is the way you need to write this. D will be isobar. What's the special name given to the parent and daughter, nucle daughter nucleus when this radiation is emitted? That will be isobar. Let's move to question number 5. This is the way you need to calculate the maximum current that the appliance can draw and calculate the resistance of the appliance that comes to 110 ohms 110 ohms then you have been given a particular diagram showing tunic fox right uh, showing tunic fox what is the frequency of tunic fox e which is placed over x that will be 320 hertz and then 
why does B produce a louder sound? That's because of resonance and that leads to large amplitude resulting in a loud sound. Because the natural frequency of E and B, E which is the tunic fog, B, uh, B one of the tu uh, tunic fogs, E is one of the tuni vibrating tunic fogs. Um, so, when the natural frequency of E and B are equal, so there is maximum energy absorption and that leads to large amplitude resulting in a loud sound. The final, oh, this is the fifth question, sorry. Uh, from the graph, you need to state the melting point and the boiling point of the substance. The melting point will be 40 degrees Celsius and the boiling point will be 160 degree Celsius. Complete and rewrite the following nuclear reaction by filling the blanks. This is the way you need to write this out. Next, let's come to the last question, which is the sixth question. Study the above figure and answer the following. What type of vibration does the above figure represent? It represents damped vibration, A. State one reason for which the amplitude of the vibration decreases with time due to resistance offered by the medium, which is air. Write an example of natural vibrations, tuning fork vibrating in vacuum or for that matter any object operating in a vibrating in a vacuum. The second one, gamma, then beta and then gamma, A, B, C. And then the sixth, the third one, if a wire of resistance to ohms gets stretched to thrice its original length, calculate the new resistance of the wire and what happens to the specific resistance of the wire. So this is how you calculate the new resistance of the wire which comes to 18 ohms and the specific resistance does not change, it remains the same. So that's the answer key to the physics paper. I hope all of you have done very well. Now some of you would be having your second language paper on the 11th, that's Wednesday, for which you need to prepare. I hope some of you have prepared chemistry in advance during the days, more number of days that you got before physics if you did not have the Hindi as Hindi as the second language. And for those who don't have to appear for the second language paper, have already appeared for Hindi, now you have 10th, 11th and 12th, not counting today, in order to prepare and revise and do well in chemistry. Thank you very much. All the best to you.